Hi friends, I'm Kazel and welcome to the fourth episode of the 2023 Digital Planner Creation Masterclass. We are now going to start creating our digital planner, so open your app or software of choice and let's begin. I am using the Keynote app and if you are using it too, tap Create Presentation. This will pop up, so select Choose a Theme. There are a number of different themes available here and you can explore each of them if you like. But for me, I want to start with a clean slate so I'm going to choose the basic white. Our main goal in this episode is to set the size and dimensions of our digital planner. And having a good dimensions will set up our digital planner to be lag free and I have already released a video on how you can find your perfect dimensions which I will link in the upper right corner and in the description box below so in here I'm going to share with you the size and dimensions I use. But before that, let's rename our presentation first. To set the dimensions of our digital planner, tap the arrow icon beside the presentation name and select presentation option. Then presentation setup then tap the slide size and set up the width and height. For my dimensions, the width that I'm going to use is 1024 and for the height, it is 690. And then tap done. And then tap done again in the upper right corner. And this is how you change the size of your digital planner. There is no perfect one size fits all digital planner size and dimensions. And this will always depend on what the priority of the digital planner creator is. But keep in mind that the bigger the dimensions are, the higher the size of the PDF file will be. And if the size of the digital planner is quite big, you might experience lags, so keep those in mind. And if you have set your digital planner dimensions, let me know what size you have used in the comments section below. Until next time, bye!